Can you give me a minute? I need to go over some stuff in my head. Uh, um, of course. Know who they are, who the woman is. Any idea how we find them? Fuck, V. I've been dead the last half century. Sorry if I'm unable to hand you all the answers on a chrome fucking platter when you snap your fingers. These people, what could they want from Alt? How the hell should I know? Got no notion whatsoever? One way or another, everything leads back to that Netrunner. Finding her is our biggest priority. If she knows as much as I think she knows about the chip, she can help us out. Thought you said nothing could help us. Nah, just find us that Juju Wirehead, okay? Delamine? Junior, as it were. You're more direct than your dear old dad. Well, it seems appropriate, uh, I suppose. So, the old man left you this mess and took off, huh? It seems that way, I suppose. I just know you're dying and in need of a driver. I'm afraid I can't help you with the former. As to the latter, uh, I'm at your service. So what? Want to get out of here? Uh, lead the way. <laughs> Excuse me. I answer you, no! Not reptilians, but werewolves. At sunset, they strip off their clothes and dance nakedly, giving in to an animalistic ecstasy. Then, once they've transformed into the fanged beasts, they set off on the hunt, hungry for human flesh. Dozens of miles they cover in the darkness, with ferocious speed, like arrows in the night. They're on looking for a cure? You'd think all those mutilated bodies would attract some attention. Would a bird seek a cure for flight? Would a star wish to dim its glow? A werewolf is a free beast, 
unbound by reptilian law. Better to become a man-eater than to live in chains. And the cause behind these monstrous horrors? Years ago, a ship from Alpha Centauri crash-landed in the Badlands. Legend tells that it carried a substance highly sought after by the vampire elite in Arasaka. It could transform Saburo's enemies into werewolves, leashed and bound to his will. But the crash well, You got a problem with nomads, freak? Better shut your fat fucking mouth before I put you six feet under. You can break my bones, but you cannot stop the pursuit of truth. Jesus, chill. Wouldn't you want people to think we're werewolves? It's fucking hardcore. Maybe the backers like childish jokes, but I'm not gonna put up with that shit. Oh, let me guess. Some kid tells you you're a gonk and you smell bad, and you cry about that too? This guy's been rambling on about hell, vampires, and necromancers from space. You seriously believe he's deliberately targeting our rep? Well, sure. His brain clearly ain't firing on all cylinders. Ugh, fuck it. I won't waste my time on a street creep. That was close. They're not as dangerous in the daylight, but it still could have ended badly. Thank you for your concern, though I could have done without the mockery. No problem. I mean, who's gonna tell me how we fake the Mars landing if I let him knock your teeth out? You have no faith in my words, do you? You think I don't know when I'm mocked, when they take me for a false prophet? It's hard to take your interpretation seriously, but there is a little truth in what you say. Sometimes even more than a little. You see it too! You know that behind a veil of darkness lurk creatures from our nightmares, but you fear to believe it! You know, if you had any kind of real evidence of this grand cosmic plot... I do! Tonight! They're meeting at an old factory in Kabuki to exchange something important! Observe them! Seize this item, this Alpha Centauri artifact! You'll see I was right from the beginning! Wait, 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 hold on. How do you even know about this meeting? Their radio waves resonate within my brain. Ever since the accident, I've heard their secret broadcasts. 